Jury selection is so difficult to teach because it varies so much from jurisdiction to jurisdiction. But I have three simple suggestions. One for your body, one for your brain, one for your voice. During jury selection, if you want the panel to be open with you, you need to be open with them, literally open. You need to make this first impression. Your body language needs to say, folks, trust me, be open with me. And the way to do that is to stand up and very comfortably immediately open and do so with gestures that are smooth and slow, which will help you establish a pace that is smooth and slow. Stand still. Look them in the eye. Be open. That will allow your body to assist what it is that you are doing in the way of getting them to talk to you. During jury selection, you want to get people talking. And to do that, Think about the questions that will achieve that goal. Ask open-ended questions. Ask those questions that begin with the who, what, when, where, why, which, how, describe, explain, or tell us from direct examination. Avoid the leading questions that begin with a verb, the did you, the were you, the are you. To those questions you will get a yes or no and not very much information. It's hard to practice jury selection because you don't know what those people will say. But you can practice how will you begin. So practice that paragraph of introduction where you introduce yourself, where you introduce your client, the kind of case this is, and then your description of the process of jury selection that they are about to go through with you. Have the language available where you will say, well, we're looking for the right jury for this case. So make sure you have some way of saying that. I heard recently a lawyer use the analogy for a referee in an athletic event. We're looking for a referee who's not prejudiced against one side or the other. It's the right jury for this case. Practice that paragraph. And with those open-ended words, getting them talking, you then need to say, well, I want to get to the most important issues in this case. How do I find out about that? I recently taught with a very gifted trial advocacy teacher, and Frank had a formula that he used in jury selection, and I've turned his formula into a gestural template as a pattern. Let me show you what I mean. So here is the gestural template for jury selection. When you get to those most important topics that you really want to delve into and find out how they feel, here's a pattern, both with words and with gestures, to help you remember it. Put the topic first out here with your gestures on the shelf. Now, this case is about a doctor, about a hospital, about a drug company, about an oil company about a big corporation, doesn't matter what the topic is, put it out there. And then show us the two extremes. Let's use doctors as an example. Now this case is about a doctor. Some people feel really positively about doctors, have had wonderful experiences. Think of doctors as the people that we turn to when we're sick or when we're dying. On the other hand, there are people who think of doctors very differently because they've had bad experiences. How do you feel about doctors? And then turn to a member of the panel. Get them talking. Describe your feelings about doctors. Turn to someone else in the panel. How do you feel about that? In other words, it's a great way to get the conversation rolling. Here's the topic. Doctors, hospitals, drug companies, oil companies, big corporations. Here are the extremes. People feel really good. People feel really bad. We're looking for the right jury, and so we want to make sure that you're not way over on this side or way over on that side. We're looking for someone in between. It gives you a way to get the discussion rolling. And once you get one person talking, you can just bounce to the next person. And how do you feel? Describe your feelings about that. Everybody has a feeling. Everyone will tell you. Or they will say, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty neutral about that. I'm somewhere in the middle. So it gives you a way to both remember it yourself. Topic, extreme, other extreme. Question, how do you feel? And that will get people talking. So that's your goal with jury selection. Practice the beginning. Practice how you will introduce yourself. Practice asking those open-ended questions. When you think about the topics that are most contentious, practice putting them on the shelf, asking that question with the two extremes, and then turning to the panel member. Once they start talking, well, who knows what they'll say. But at least you will make that positive first impression of telling them exactly what the process will be and using that process to get the information you need so you can pick the right jury.